Hi everyone, welcome back. We will be doing another Bible reading today. This is Monday, so we're starting off our week with another Bible reading. Um, this is Exodus chapter 12, verse 33 through 42. This is called the Exodus from Ramses to Sukkoth. The Egyptians urged the people to hasten their departure from the land, for they said, we shall all be dead. So the people took their dough before it was leavened with their kneading bowls wrapped up in their cloaks on their shoulders. The Israelites had gone as Moses told them. They had asked the Egyptians for jewelry of silver and gold and for clothing. And the Lord had given the people favor in the sight of the Egyptians so that they, so that they let them have what they asked. And so they plundered the Egyptians. The Israelites journeyed from Ramses to Sukkoth, about 600 thousand men on foot besides children a mixed crowd also went up with them and livestock in great numbers both flocks and herds they baked unleavened cakes of the dough that was not that they had brought out of egypt it was not leavened because they were driven out of egypt and could not wait nor had they prepared any provisions for themselves the time that the israelites had lived in egypt was 430 years at the end of 430 years on that very day all the companies of the lord went out from the land of egypt that was for the Lord a night of vigil, to bring them out of the land of Egypt. That same night is a vigil to be kept for the Lord by all the Israelites throughout the generations. Okay, so we learn. This is basically telling us the Egyptians are finally being freed, finally getting to leave Egypt, finally getting to have their freedom um, because of the 10th plague that we learned about last Friday. So they basically are leaving they're bringing in all this food with them they're bringing the dough that they can and all these things that they need right to survive so they do that and they're leaving and all the egyptians are basically severely harmed a lot are dead all these bad things have happened to them because pharaoh won't listen right so the israelites are leaving they're finally after 400 some years of being in captivity and being enslaved by the egyptians um they're finally free the israelites get to go and it basically says that that day will be remembered as a day that they were freed, as the day that God let them go, as a day that they were finally had their own freedom from the Egyptians. So um, basically a day to be remembered. So that's it for this story. Um, take it how you will, day to be remembered, whatever. Um, I think it's very important. So we will finish chapter 12 tomorrow and I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you tomorrow